Did you know that one scientist's invention killed millions of people in two different wars? Fritz Haber stood at the Second Battle of Ypres on April 22, 1915, watching his deadly creation come to life. The Nobel Prize-winning chemist had convinced the German military to try something the world had never seen before. Chemical warfare, 6,000 metal cylinders lined a four-mile front, each one filled with chlorine gas. When the wind shifted, soldiers opened the valves. 168 tons of yellow-green death rolled across no man's land. Allied troops ran screaming as the cloud burned through their lungs, drowning them in their own blood. The gas created a massive gap in enemy lines, but Haber's victory came with a terrible price. His wife Clara shot herself with his service pistol that very night, unable to live with what he had done. Years later, Haber's research led to Zyklon B, the gas used in Nazi death camps. One man's ambition had created an entirely new way to suffer.